this week the bonus task is based on the assignment. So it's quite similar, however it gets a little bit more complex. In the assignment we had a fixed number of shifts, namely this five, which enabled us to build a dictionary. Now should these number of shifts be parameterized, so you see first we have to enter the shift and this leads to a situation that a dictionary doesn't work anymore. So what can we do? Another solution is to work using the indices and having our alphabet in the variable ABC. So how does this help? What we can do, we can, I will do now some experiments first, we can find out an index. Yeah, so if I say, for example, index equals to ABC, I would like to find a certain character, let's say the character A, yeah, and say, I would like to print index, then you see I get the zero, yeah? or if I search for another character, the O, I get another one, and the Z replaces with a um, 25. So what I can do is then in the next step, I'll add another um, shift. So I say index equals to index plus shift and this shift I have to enter here first shift for example equals to, to 5. Yeah, so again I go in here let's say I have an A and uh, I get this 5 because A is a 0 plus a shift is a 5. And on top I can now say I um, get a new character so I say character is equal to ABC and then the index yeah, and I print this character out. So what you can see if I enter the A, I shift it by 5, I'll enter, I come up with this letter F. Yeah, I can do another one, so let's give it a no. This is a 19 then and uh, is replaced by a T. And we can check the Z. And here we see we have a problem. Yeah, suddenly we have this index which goes up to 30 and 30 um, is not in our index anymore. It's out of range, so we get an error. So what could we do? Yeah, we can, let's say in a first try, say if index is bigger than 25, then we start from scratch and say, index minus equals to 26. Yeah, and again, now it works. Yeah, so you see the Z yeah, is 25. We add 5, it's 30. We subtract 26 and we end with a 4, which is the E, which has been the substitution as it, as it has been done in the assignment. This one can be simplified. Yeah? If you have this turning around and around and around, then often the modulo operator is the best solution. So if you say we have this sum of index plus shift and we do a mod 26 because we have 26 characters, um, then it is doing actually the same and we are getting rid of this nasty if statement. So let's do it again. Yeah, you see the force. Z is E, the A is the F, and uh, the O uh, still is substituted by a T. Having all this, we can now start to solve our program. To start our program, we um, start like we have done before, but first we have to get these input for our shifts. So we say shift equals to, we have to convert this input. Yeah. And then we again ask for our plain text. This one we do not have to convert it is a, as it is a string.
and this one we first um, convert into our lower equivalent. Text equals to plain text dot lower. And before we loop, we have to have our initial version of our secret text, which is an empty string. And now we can loop over our plain text for character in plain text. So we first check if this character is in our ABC, in our alphabet. If character in ABC. And what we do then is exactly what we have looked up before. So we first check for the index. Index equals to abc dot find our character. We now um, add our shift index equals to index plus shift. And uh, now we take this modulo again. Mod 26. And uh, finally, we say our character equals to ABC um, and our new index. So now we have replaced our character and if it is a non alphabet can character we have done nothing independent of our situation we now add it to our secret text plus equal to character and finally we can print out our solution so let's give it a try yeah python is still cool We get a value error shift and oh, we first have to enter our shifts, of course. So let's restart, enter our shifts. Yeah. Python is still cool. And here we get our solution. And uh, what we can, of course, do is a nice test. Yeah. So if we say places to shift is zero then actually nothing should change. Python is still cool. So the secret text is not really secret, but uh, you can see that beside um, this lowering of characters, everything is identical as before.